artist friends! Today, we are going to make a motion portrait. So we are going to learn how to do the correct proportions for our face. And then we are either going to make, let's do a mad face for our friends. No, a happy one. Okay, let's do a happy face for our friends. You ready? Yeah. No, no, let's, let's show them first. Now, can you, what, what other emotions can we show our friend? Sad? Happy? What about angry? What about surprised? What about scared? Uh, what about excited, excited, excited? Okay, so you... Can you say what I'm in, uh, scared about? Oh, what are you scared about, Jelly? I'm scared about there's going to be a lot of monsters here. <gasps> We're scared of monsters too! And then, can I tell you what I'm happy about? I'm so happy that the sun is out today and I get to make art with my favorite human, Jali. So me let me too. show you. Happy, happy. Okay, so we need paper. We need pencil. Step one, we're going to draw with pencil. Step two, we're going to trace with marker. Step three, we're going to use crayons or paint or markers to color in. So everybody gets one sheet of paper to start. We're going to do one piece, one portrait at a time. We're each going to get a pencil. Okay. Step one is you're going to draw a big oval. That's going to be the face. So. Big oval? What? Good job. Good job. Step two on our oval, we are going to draw one line going down and one line going across. Let's start from over here. Across. Good. This is important. These are the guidelines for our portrait. I'm going to do one more line right here. That's another guide. Okay? It's not at all. These are where the eyes go on the middle line. Believe it or not, your eyes are right in the middle from the top of your head and the bottom of your chin. It's hard to see that because we have a hairline, um, but the eyes are actually right in the middle. Then that second line, which is right underneath, which is right in the middle of the middle line and the bottom of the chin, that's where the bottom of your nose is. And then there's even one more line right here, and that one more line is in the middle of your lips. So these are where your eyes go, this is where the bottom of your nose goes, this is where the middle of your lips go. Now it's very important that you draw your expressions, and the easiest way to draw the expression is if you're sad, your mouth is gonna be going down like a frown and your eyebrows might be looking kind of sad. And if you're happy, your mouth will probably go up. You might, might be slightly open. You might be showing some teeth. So you have to decide what expression you wanna draw. So first we're gonna draw our eyes. Oh, look at your eyes and you look like boing. Okay, you're gonna draw your eyes right here on those two lines. Go ahead and draw your eyes. Good. Mine's a boy. Now the bottom of your nose is at the this line right here. And actually, first, we're going to draw two lines going down from this, the middle end of the eye straight. So you can tell mine is sad because my eyebrows and the mouth, right? All right, now we're going to do a neck. All I Step one, we draw on pencil. So draw your hair. You just need your hair now. Let's draw your hair. Ugh, look at my hair. It's curly. Nice curly hair.
Okay, now we are ready for step two. We're gonna trace with our Sharpie marker. So we're gonna trace our lines as best we can. Oh, we're gonna erase our grid line. We're not gonna trace the grid line. So we don't wanna trace that. Tricky part is the hail. My so called hail, but I try my best when I'm so called hail. Bye, artist friends. Well, bye, artist friends. There's our portraits.